hello, hello. <coughs> <coughs> Hi. Oh. Got a bit of an echo, but that is fixed. All right. Um, yeah, I think I'm good to go. Right. Uh, just double check. One more time. That'll work, right? I think so. Stupid camera. That'll, that'll work right there. Yeah. So, hi, hello, welcome uh, to another wonderful stream. <laughs> uh, playing Tears of the Kingdom today. Otra vez. Because uh, it's a fun game. And I like it. And it is time to carry on into a shrine, I guess? Question mark. Uh, which shrine am I at? What is this? Um, this, is, this is in uh, the Zora village. Zadius! May your journey today be free from Lionels. <laughs> As every journey should be. <laughs> I, I appreciate the sentiment, but that's absolutely no guarantee. <laughs> oh, there's some There's some spooky Lionel shit in the abyss by the way <laughs> uh, I, don't, I don't know if you saw like in one of my playthroughs but uh <laughs> nope <laughs> no 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 it's uh, uh there's there's a coliseum down there with not one lionel but several uh, also i got a diamond sweet um, also my projector's like funny let me fix this real quick all right pretty please Try that again. Ah, good enough. That'll work. All right. Yes. Yeah, like I, I marked it on the map, so I have, you know, the capability to go back to this Lionel arena. Um, but in my current state, apps, no, I, I can't. <laughs> I think there were a total of like six or seven Lionels in that Coliseum, and they're all behind like gates and stuff. So they're not going to release them all at once. Unless they do. Like, I don't know what they're going to do. <laughs> um, but yeah. This, I, no. <laughs> I could I could handle one. Like, I did handle one not too long ago. But not that many. At, at some point. <laughs> I want to try it. <sighs> uh, but yeah, what was, it, what was it up to last time? Oh, that's right. I wanted to go complete the Fire Temple. Um, although, do I want to get some extra hearts? Because I just noticed I'm at seven of the blessings of light, or light blessings. If I get one more, I can go get two hearts, which doesn't sound all too bad. Getting two extra hearts. Let's, just, let's do that. Let's get a couple shrines first, and then go make our way to the fire temple. Hmm. Oh, I didn't think about that little tooltip that just popped up. It said you can use Tullin's gust, the Sky Tullin, his little wahoo thing. Like it helps you travel with the glider, sure. But they mentioned that it also can push rafts, and I'm thinking now, like obviously, of course it can. <laughs> Why wouldn't it? <laughs> uh, but it didn't register until someone just pointed it out point blank. Uh, so let's see. Let's see what this shrine is about. It's, it's, Called the Yonasu Shrine, right? Right, Yonasu. Yonose. Skippity skip. This is a combat one. Yonasao. Yo Yonsao. Yonsao. Deep Force is what it's called. Also, Tihihi. Giggity. <laughs> all, that, all that good business. Um, Alright, it's one of these little things. The Floaty Magoos. <laughs> Right, you do your floating business. So I, I take it, I just... Yeah, Deep Force. <laughs> deep Force Space Nine. I'm trying to say Deep Space Nine with Force. Uh, is that it just let go? Yeah, okay. Buoyancy. Buoyancy does the trick. What a strange Zonai device, this, this beach ball, as you call it. It looks very jovial, but dangerous. <laughs> you figured this one out faster than you did. Oh, no. <laughs> what, what can I say? Link's a beach boy. He knows what beach balls do. 
Well, this link anyway. I mean, look at him. He has a sled on his fucking back. He's a bro. He likes sports. <laughs> That's a beach ball. I know what it does. Also, hi. Uh, just smack you. Yeah. Oh, bro. Shit. It took a shield away. So actually, I'm taking that from you. <laughs> oh shit, I can't. Ah, oh, nuts. Um, I can hold it above your head. <laughs> It's not going to do anything. <laughs> uh, can I just fuse it onto another shield? You know what? Forget it. Just get a weapon. If we smack him hard enough, we don't have to worry about the shield. Um, shit, I have some things I don't want to use or need. Like these rods, for example. Um, I have them, but I'm not using them. So I should just get rid of them and replace them. So I think I will. If a better weapon pops up, I will absolutely use it. Yeah, you're screwed. Thank you for the stick. <laughs> I'm not gonna replace a magical rod with a stick. Uh, do I want to attach this shield to another shield? The forest dwellers shield. Eh, no, I'm just gonna leave it. Leave the old wooden shield alone. Also, I'm curious if there's anything in the water because yes, of course there will be. <laughs> they hide this shit all the time. All right, come, 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 come to me. Probably an opal, some rupees. Mm. Oh wow, a strong construct bow with plus 10 attack for a total of 21. Let us replace the current bow I have. That's absolutely better. All right, um, I presume nothing else. All right, yeah. Uh, but let's see, what now? Mm. Okay, it's another bouncy bounce, right? It's a little flotation buoy thing. Yeah, but this is not a ball. It's flat. So I... I'm assuming that it's not just going to float upwards on its own. Like if I go under underwater, it's just going to be slightly just sh fall short. All right. Oh, you don't even go up at all. Oh. Um. I'd have to go get the ball <laughs> from the other one. <laughs> so I can't just bring it. I, I, I think I can. Um, but okay, fine. If you're not going to do that, what about this? Will this send you up higher? Ah. <laughs> it did. <laughs> That looked like a pop tart. <laughs> oh, and it still floats the same way. Oh, that's a bit creepy. Oh, that's a bit unsettling. Is the water that still, or are you that magical? I don't like it. <laughs> uh, okay, so one more ball. Um, so that's that's like wood, right? I can just I could reach if I wanted to. Can I? Can I just touch it with this. Can I make them kiss? Eh, not quite. Doesn't quite reach there. Um, okay, so I have to break it. Break the wood. With the ball. Um, but how can I tell where the wood is? I think I just have to kind of guess. And say approximately there? Let's see. Let go. Uh, no. Not sure if that touched or... No, I think that got the corner up there. Because it wouldn't have bounced at an angle unless it hit a corner. So yeah, let's try it here. That got it. Yeah. Oh, that's oh. It's <laughs> a bit of a mess. <laughs> uh, excellent. Oh, that's not the end of it, is it? No. I don't know. To get the ball underneath the platform to make it go bouncy bounce. Uh, but once I do that, it's gonna launch it, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it will launch it. So I think I have to. Put the ball here for now, so it doesn't roll away. Let's just stick it on there, make sure it doesn't look like go away. Get on the platform myself, and then do the bouncy bounce. Okay, wiggle, wiggle. Okay, down you go. Are you are you underneath me? Are you? Oh, <laughs> that didn't quite work. <laughs> not sure what happened there, but it was not success. Unless it was success, and I just don't know what it looks like. Right, let's try that again. And can I just reach the ball from like here? I mean, I should be able to, right? Okay, so I don't have to. I don't have to stick the ball to this thing, right? I can just put it right underneath and then let go. It's a bit hard to tell with all the uh, uh, lack of depth perception. I think there's good enough. That's underneath me. So yeah, let go. And yeah, up we go. <laughs> Sweet, I've never been up here before. Cool. <laughs> Sorry, I'm all up in your magic. Little magic tornado twister thing. 
Excellent. I don't think I missed anything. I already got the one chest. Is it always just one chest in these shrines? Or there's sometimes two or more. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. All right, yes, yes, yes. Give me your blessing. I am blessed by the gods of Polly. I will join your polycule. <laughs> Like, are all the shrines part of the same polycule? <laughs> or is it all separate? <laughs> or I guess it's interweaved, I guess. But sweet, yeah, that got us to eight light blessings. So I am going to go get some some more health. Two extra hearts. Um, so the nearest, uh, whatchamacallit, goddess statue. I, I found one in a well, um, and I marked it. So where's a heart icon? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> hey, my, my wife and I, we... Notice you from across the shrine. <laughs> we really like your vibe. <laughs> it's like, whoa, thanks, buddy. <laughs> um, I like your vibe, too. Mm -hmm, that's about as far as I'm going to go. <laughs> um, yeah, where was that freaking um, fairy? There it is, right here, this one. Is this it? No, that's a Korok. That's not a heart. <laughs> I'm looking for a heart. Because um, I marked where... Oh, it's up here, isn't it? Oh, it is, but I have no fucking uh, war point up here, so... Mm. Uh, well, there's that one there, but that's kind of far away. I can just go to lookout point or whatever. Lookout landing. Um, so, no. I'm just going to go back to lookout landing. Right? Lookout landing? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go there. Mm-mm-mm. So yeah, after this, go get the fire temple. Primarily because I want Unobo's power. The whole rolling really quickly like a cannonball to break apart rocks. I want that power for any cave exploration and abyss stuff to do. And to break like ores without like costing anything. No durability. I can open up a weapon slot, like I, I want all of that. Ah, so yes. Also the music. Feels different. I like it. Reminds me of the like daylight sunrise little tune that plays in Ocarina of Time. It's it's not sunlight or sunrise. It's 9:50. <laughs> uh, but it's reminiscent of that. Just silence, an introduction, a motif maybe, and then go on with your day. All right, goddess, we're here. I wish for more power. Please. You have conquered the shrines and claimed their blight blessings. Give me, give me some and I'll give you more life. I am making you weaker for no apparent reason. Thank you, lady. And number two. Right? Like, they have a lot of power, these goddesses. Right? <laughs> like, they are providing Link... I was just thinking this, like, as this cutscene was going on. Like, they are giving Link the power to, like, kill Ganon. But they're not using it themselves. Um, actually, I'm getting a phone call real quick. I have to answer that real quick, so...
I've returned. Hello. Um, wait, what the heck happened here? Got myself on three screens. Because, no, two screens. Anywho, hi everybody, again. <laughs> I've returned. Um, oh, that's right, this fucking thing. Well, I'm not going to go to the Skylands yet. Right, where'd you say to go to the east somewhere? Right? My first job, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're feeling lucky, Kakariko Village. Okay. <laughs> I wonder if that's how I have to, like, take care of those, like, ring islands or whatever. Also, yay! <laughs> um, anywho, yeah. Okay, so if I want to do these Hylian text island things, I took a picture of one a long, long time ago. I have to go to Kakariko Village. Uh, but yes. Uh, what's I going to do? Yes, I got the hearts. Now time to go underground to the fire temple. <laughs> <laughs> uh, before I do that, I should probably prepare a little bit, just get some extra, like, food stuffs, fire protection, that kind of stuff. I already have some armor that will take care of getting caught on fire, so that takes care of that. Um, I don't really, oh, this I should equip also, because extra damage, and also because it's hot down there. Uh, some fierce boots. And anything else? No. Also, I just noticed I can make almost a complete Link set. <laughs> almost looks like regular Link. <laughs> like OG Link, right? <laughs> fierce. <laughs> They're literally called Fierce Duty Boots. <laughs> These make you stronger, literally. It's fantastic. <laughs> I want to get the whole set, because it's, it's, it's hilarious to me. <laughs> Also, it's a, it's a cool armor set, because it's the fucking, like, um, Deity Link or whatever from Majora's Mask. That character is the final, final, final boss. Uh, it's even bigger in person. Yes, Queen, pop off. <laughs> uh, to the Fire Temple. I think I'm ready. I'm, just, I don't, I'm not going to worry about food. If we need someone, just come back and make some. <laughs> it's not that hard to just exit the Fire Temple and come back. <sighs> <laughs> oh, I like the map a lot. The map system. Because they incorporate um terrain, elevation, yeah. into the maps. Oh, you know, but you're back. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, you never left. You were here the whole time, right? <laughs> it's you who's the main character, not me. <laughs> um, uh, but yes, like the darker the floor, the lower in elevation it is. So the bright spots are the high spots. Which tells you things like there's walls and things. Like you can tell the brighter little spots going across, those are walls. Um, but yes, anywho, oh boy, uh, time to explore the fire temple. <laughs> uh, this is a fucking amusement park is what it is. There's just like tracks everywhere. Um, and actually, I think it tells you what tracks you've already been on. Because this is highlighted, clearly. Uh, but the other ones aren't. Huh. That I mean, that might be useful information. But anywho, um, yeah, let's just go. I guess to one of the tracks and just see where it takes us. Let's just explore. Um, yes, where's the nearest one? Actually, there's a zone over there. Oh, I've not actually seen this. So yes, let's be sneaky, sneaky, Mr. Giant Goron, as much as you can be. And they are. They're not really patrolling, are they? He's just kind of there. You know, but can you take. Actually, you know, but you dispatch him, please. <laughs> uh, Alright, you're done. Thank you for the stuff. That's just a bow. And we can make a weapon, so that's good. Mm, yeah, okay, sure. Let's go here. Oh, I should absolutely uh, take one of these fire hydrants and equip it to a fucking shield. Oh, should I do the mighty Zonai shield with the fire hydrant on it? <laughs> uh, I, I say that because it'll help reduce the like wear on the shield. But I like this shield. 50 fucking defense. That's... I feel like I need that for emergencies. For boss battles and things. So maybe not that one. I guess I'm fine just attaching it to one of these. Like I'm not using them. Um, I should replace that maybe. No, just grab a regular Hylian night shield or whatever. And then attach you to the hydrant. And now we have a shield that shoots water, right? Right, right? Sure do. <laughs> Excellent. 
All right. Um, yeah, so before I guess going on any of the little tracks, you just go across here first. But how much water is needed is my question. Um, uh, not, an not an insignificant amount. Uh, but I should save the shield durability. All right, I should just use these. We'll just pop on. No, ouchie. I think I have to activate it, don't I? And then I can... Yeah, activate first and then you can pick it up. All right. Yeah, this way my shield isn't eaten up. Also, will these little yeah. slabs... Oh! <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> uh, there was a gap there. Mind the lava gap. So, yes, let's retry. Also, I think our f hydrant, like, uh, disappeared into the depths of the lava. <laughs> I also forgot to activate it. So, let's uh, drop it. Smack it. Pick it up and create one more. Pretty please, will you? Um, so that's, I guess that works. Can I just plug up the lava? Is that an option? I wonder. Um, like I don't want to fall again. It's the other thing. Can I just stop you, Eternal? I sure can't. But what? I, I can't create a lot of slabs. So also these like disappearing. I'm just get off of them. <laughs> They're smoking. Uh, I don't like that. All right, so I did see this object before. Um, it just turns the track around. She's to turn your card around when it's on there, so it's just an easy way to, like, you know, uh, reset. But yes, those things. I presume those change the track directions. So instead of like going f forward, you're going right here, which means you're going to loop around. So that's going to happen. That seems to be correct, but I do want to just verify it. Looks like it does loop around, so but we'll see. We'll see. All right, let's uh, let's hitch a ride. Also, get rid of this fire hydrant shield. That looks ridiculous. <laughs> uh, let's do the sled shield. Sure. Uh, I I didn't ask you, Nobo, but thank you. <laughs> I mean, you could knock that off, I guess. Uh, let's try again. Oh, missed it. Uh, okay, can we try one more time? Here I go. Please, uh, that way. I mean, I want to get it before I leave, actually, so I'm going to make one more loop around. <laughs> uh, okay, we're right there. Right, excellent. Here I go. Right, uh, no, thank you, Nobo. I'm fine. Don't need your assistance yet. Actually, we'll need it to uh, change the track direction. Right there. Yeah, so this thing like curve. We have to aim a little bit upwards. Yes, we... Oh, we'll be stopped here. Excellent. Right. Turn this off. Uh, what's all this business? Um, this is, looks like a little minecart car wash. <laughs> They're being rinsed away. All the nasty filth. Okay, so somebody sees us. Whoa! It's a... A lava-like? Fire-like? It is a fire-like. Okay. So I can't recall if it, the fireballs like float... They do, okay. Oh, you're right, yes. Thank you. Probably should use like an ice arrow or something, but our man here will get it. Actually, can we please get the eye of the fire like? <laughs> Alright, excellent, excellent. We got one zonite from it. Oh, we're, we are underground, so I guess that makes sense. Also, no, no, no. Gimme, 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 gimme. I would like the fire like stone, please. And what's in here? It's a weapon, I'm gonna replace one of the rods. So let's see, strong zonite shield. Um, yes, I will take that in exchange for, uh, bye bye Kodak shield, as much as I like you. <laughs> uh, we should take a picture of you before we go. Keep forgetting. Forest dweller's shield. Thank you for the entry into the compendium. Oh, it's catching fire now! <laughs> Oh, jeez. <laughs> Let me abandon you. <laughs> then take a picture of you before you incinerate and die. Um, oh, you know, Bo, you cannot aim diagonally forward. I mean, I you can do it on the cart, but for some reason not here. Um, that's okay. I think the solution is to get some little water that's up here and use it to create a little path for him to like roll on 
Like, I'm hoping he's gonna, like, go down the path, like, get on the little slab of lava that I'm about to create, and then back upwards. Like, fall to the ground, essentially. Uh, but let's see if that actually happens or not. Alright, let's see. Put one there. Um, is that enough? Do I need, like, to cover the whole little path? Uh, maybe. I'm not creating any more. Maybe he'll bounce, I don't know. Let's see, let's just try. Let's actually turn you off as well. Alright, come here, you know Uh Aim there, see what happens. Uh, no, he will bounce off whatever surface he hits. So you can't just go across, really? It seems a bit strange. Let me actually try, just face him. Shoot. Uh, that worked. I guess he does bounce off. All right, sweet. <laughs> we got another door open. Uh, where does that? Where would that take us? It's just a single room. So, yeah, we'll do that then. We'll go in there. Uh, but first, anything else around this area? I could climb, and there's actually an enemy up there. Hmm. Who is up there? Is it a Zonai? Another like like. I guess that's the second floor. I should maybe just go back down and explore the rest of that little area. Um, yeah, let's go explore that room first, and then we'll go upwards. So, yes. Let's go! Thank you, Tolan, for the unnecessary gust of air. And now what? Oh, little something else. Whoa, Link, check that out! Oh, what is that thing? It looks like a gong! Oh, I bet you're the one who fuck has to whack it, don't you? <laughs> well, thanks for the insight, Yunobo. That's all you have to say. <laughs> mm. Oh, we should take those, yes. Some hydrants. I just give you good old hydrants. Can smack it open. Yeah. Refreshing. Actually, does the temperature change if I'm in the water? My little meter? Mm, it does not, no. Unfortunate, but that's fine. All right, Yunobo, uh, do, do your thing, man. Ring the gong. I can do it. Yeah. Oh, that's a spooky-looking face. <laughs> oh, that was too loud. That must be the first padlock, Link. Oh, there are four more for us to find. That's a lot. Oh man. Well, d don't worry, buddy. We'll get there. <laughs> um, oh, am I steaming because I just had water on me and it's all evaporating? Is that what's going on? Because Link doesn't usually steam, does he? <laughs> right? It's not something people do regularly. Um, Alright. At any rate, um, can I go upwards? Can I exit this room from below? Is it too high up? I think it's too high up. You can climb here, see if that gets me the distance. Let's see, also, there's like battle music going on. Or am I imagining things? I think it's the Fire Temple music, like getting a bit more uh, animated. Because I noticed it did that in the Zora like domain as well. Or not Zora, um, the first temple, the Rito Temple. Like, as you progress, the music got, like, more and more involved, more complicated. You start to hear more motifs. I can definitely sense it now. There's, like, drums playing, for example. Some percussion. Some weird plucky basses. The music is getting more interesting. Alright, yeah, I'm just examining all of the fucking, like, walls and stuff. I don't want to miss anything. Also, there's brass. Alright, so I Construct, I think we can just get you brute force, can't we? Yeah, I think we will. Get you in the eye first. Excellent, that almost got you, so one more smack. Yep, one more smack. Sweet. We'll take all your things. Um, I, thought was, I thought that was an enemy that is just Unobo. Being Unobo. Uh, strong Construct bow, no thank you. Ooh, chest. Qu'est-ce que c'est? Say, a diamond, sure. 
I have several of these diamonds now. Like, I kind of want to make a diamond blade. <laughs> it sounds like fun. It, I mean, it would probably look really cool, too. Really cool, too. Because they do a good job, like, making the... I have to lift it up. That's funny. Also, what's that noise? This arrow... Oh, it's the... The Zonai. Yeah. Should I try to snipe him before he, uh... Comes around? Just get him out of the way, because he's going to be shooting us regardless. Also, they curve this little track to make it just ever so slightly more difficult to, like, get him. So, let's see. Come on, Link. He's coming. He's coming. No. I'd need, like, the key eyeball to get him. But it's fine. We'll... We'll just deal. Alright. Let's a go. Smacky, smacky. Smacky, smacky. There we go. I guess since I said key sideball, let's uh, or we could just blow him up. <laughs> let's try the key sideball first. <laughs> I can't see. You know what? Fine, blow him up. Kaboom. Oh, it just barely scraped him, but uh, <laughs> it dropped him. <laughs> oh, we got a stuff too. Nice. Um, okay, so this is just going to loop around, isn't it? Ugh, that was a bit rough. Oh, do you have to get on his? No. I would like to get on the middle track. Is that where I want to go? Um, no, I don't think so. So it came from there, that's where I ended up. Oh, I had to move the cart up. There was a barrier there, I see. Um, so is there anything I can do from here? Am I just gonna loop around forever? Um, yeah, like I'm trying to see if there's anything I can shoot, any rocks or stuff, but no. I may have done that previously, so yeah, we just have to get off somehow. How do we get off? It's the other question. Just jump. <laughs> I think it's just jump. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh shit. Um, like I'm hoping there's a better way to get off of there, but it doesn't doesn't seem like it. At least they give you little platforms at the bottom to like latch onto. Um, like little lava things down there. So let's just, I guess, jeez, it was very very carefully. Like, what are my other options? <laughs> Except just flying around the fire temple, jeez. Alright, yeah, I'll just have to jump across. This is fine. This is fine. I uh, should probably take some hearts. Uh, yeah, this one takes me to the middle track. Uh, but unfortunately, I don't have a cart. I have to go fetch one from up there. So yeah, let's do that. Let's go fetch one of the carts. Yeah, let me eat some steak or something. Let me eat some food. I need three hearts. What do I have that's three hearts? That I don't really care for, like cold resistance. Uh, this is five. That's a lot. Um, four, two, two, five, six, that's six now. Uh, sneaky mild fruit, meaty rice balls, meat and rice bowl. Salt grilled meat almost does it. Sure, how about some salt grilled meat? And um, a, a couple apples. <laughs> that sounds like a meal. <laughs> That'll fill you right up, Link. Eat two of them, please. There we go. Alright, I think I gotta grab uh, the fucking cards uh, carefully. Uh, there it is. There it is. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, turn that fan off, first of all. So I guess we can actually turn you around. That we're not going to go anywhere. So put you there. Yeah, and just quit it, quit it, quit it, quit it. Alright, so i got to take you down now. Although, can I save this? Is, is the minecart an item that I can save? Let me see. Can I just save this thing? I guess I would have to deconstruct it, right? Yeah, it has to be my own creation. So, yeah, can I just take the fan off? Oh, I can't. It's uh, just there, permanently. Huh. Okay. Whatever. That's fine. It's an item you can make, but not here. It just comes pre-made. Alright, so we'll set you down. I doubt you'll break. And, oops. Let's try it again. And put you now on the other side of this barrier. Also, there's a freaking thing down here the whole time. Damn it. <laughs> ah! I brought the one from upstairs when I didn't have to. <laughs> 
Okay, now I can like plug this back on. And it says, yes, I can make that from this point forward. Sweet, I will save you. Um, set as a favorite. How many favorites can you have also? Um, actually, we don't need you in the favorites. We have in schematics. So yeah, yeah, all right. So whenever I want a minecart, I can now make it. So we're gonna go this way, right? So we came from there, yeah. yeah. Alright. Here I go! Vamanos! Let's actually go somewhere this time. Alright, where to? Is this gonna go just around the first floor? Hmm. Yes, it will. <laughs> um, unless this is somewhere new. I don't think so. Um, unless we go left? I mean right? Have we gone right? Have we gone to this side of it yet? Uh, no, because this is new. This little bridge here that's uh, out. <laughs> um... Yeah, if we took the rails, we would end up here. So I want to check this out first before I continue. Um, see, also, we're on the second floor now, aren't we? Yeah, okay. So we're on the second floor. Uh, but let's see how to get to there. Also, is there a faster way to get to here? I think so. Ooh, I think so. If I create like a lava platform underneath this uh, balcony, get up here with the scent. So yeah, let's do that. Um, so I think I can just like shoot it, right? Can I do that? Just shoot it to change it? I don't have to use Unobo? I guess it, I could just use Unobo real quick. Yeah, we'll change the track that way. That's the only way to change it, yeah. Overthinking it. <laughs> Alright. Unobo, sir. Make your way to the front, please. I can do it! Yes, yes, I know you can do it. And change! Change! Right Barely! <laughs> and I got it. Um, oh, it's gonna stop us here. Okay, so we're not gonna just fly off the bridge. It stops us. Um, actually, I wonder if the water hydrants will, like, just kill you instantly. No, it'll probably turn into rock. Just regular, like, uh, pebbles or whatever. Also, amber, sweet. No, 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 Peblet, no, no. Also, we don't have any uh, pictures of you. Igno Peblet. Yeah, Igno, Ig Igneo Peblet. All right. Can you take care of him, please? Thank you. <laughs> I don't want to waste my weapon durability on it. <clears throat> okay, so yes, I think clearly this will change the track. Right. Yes. So that'll take us in that direction, which is just an empty room? Is there a third floor up there? No, is there a first floor? No, so what's there? Maybe it's just access to this side, like through some like breaks in the wall here. Hmm, maybe, but I want to check out this little spot here first. Uh, yes, what is over here? Um, more carts, uh, but what do you do? You, is that an angled bridge? It is, okay. Hmm. I guess the question is which switch side first, the left track or the right track? Uh, I'm gonna do the right track, it's the smaller room. All right, there's nothing. We can go higher in that one, but not this one. Also, you know, Bo, can you break down? I can do it! Oh, I can't, I can't aim you up there, can I? Yeah, no. Uh, yes, all right. Come back, you know, Bo, please. I'm glad he just appears. Like, we sent him off into the lava, <laughs> but he found his way back somehow. <laughs> Here I go. He, he's magical in his own way. Yeah, don't, we don't need you, you know, but you're fine. Um, yes, what is all this? It's an extra minecart. Just on a track, like a little display model. I like it. I like it quite a bit. Just take a screeny. Oh, a construct. Um, can you shoot you in the eye? Yeah, one shot. Gimme, gimme, gimme. 
and a Zonite Shield. Um, don't have space for a Zonite Shield or a Rusty Broadsword. So, nah. Mm. Ah, chest. Yes, thank you. I presume nothing all too useful. Ten arrows is actually useful. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, anything else in here? There's a halberd. Um, and some more mine carts. What else? So there are there are breaks in the wall, as the map kind of alluded to. Anything I can do with this information? Just needs to be a break in the wall to get you up higher. All right, we just go up higher. Where are we going? That's oh, a 90 degree angle. Not gonna climb. That's not gonna climb. Yeah, it's up here. Third floor. Okay. These are huge fucking structures, by the way. Jeez. Okay, so the map doesn't show that we can get up here. Like it's blank. The third floor is blank. We're clearly walking here. So it makes me wonder. Is this like part of a puzzle? Or is it just you're here? Congratulations, there's nothing of interest, that's why we didn't put a map there. <laughs> there's nothing here. Um I mean I could climb up there if I really wanted to. Um, should I? Or is it all 90 degree angles? Is there anywhere that I can't go? That looks climbable. Except maybe that little angle there. Uh, no, even so, I can go up that pillar there. Up there. Yeah, let's. I sure. Let's try. Why not? I'm already here. <laughs> let's just try to climb this wall. Take it to the fourth floor. Um, I do want to use a movement elixir because this is just <laughs> a little tedious for me. So. Let's go faster. Speed up. Vamos. It's just slightly faster, but um, what's the matter? Why is he crouching? Uh, why is he crouching? I, I didn't do this. This is the Link doing himself. Is there an invisible wall here? Is that what's going on? That's very un-Zelda-like, so I want to say no. Let me try that again. I took an elixir for this, dang it. <laughs> um, let's try climbing here instead. I think we got we just got stuck in there. Yeah, okay, alright, that was a little bug. Uh, maybe not a bug, just a little eccentricity. Alright, yeah, I think we'll make it. Yeah, fourth floor. Yeah. Not sure if this is the way we're supposed to get here, but we're here. So yeah, let's see what awaits us up here in the fourth floor. <laughs> what, happens, what happens if you just go high? All right. Be very careful. Do not fall off the edge. <laughs> um, so there's a bunch of lava here. I could make a hydrant because they gave us a couple. Right, just to go across this platform maybe. Oh, hi, you Nobo. <laughs> Thanks for joining. <laughs> It's actually a fifth floor. Shit. Um, okay. Also, did, did the adventure log give us the locations of the things? I think they usually do. Right, Princess Zelda. If you go to the five places, yeah, this one. If you go to the five places, indicated by the mysterious voice, you might be able to clear the way to Zelda. So yes, all right, they're here. So there is a, a thing here. Um, a gong, I suppose. So I could do that, but I actually kind of prefer not to have that just on my mini map. If I want it, I'll take it, but I don't need it now, so no. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna create a fire hydrant now. Um, just to... Ah, well, not a fire hydrant, just a hydrant. Ah, it's in the lava! <laughs> don't come back! <laughs> Shit. Ah, I don't know. Don't know why you fell in there. I was facing this way. That's okay. Uh, no, we gotta activate it first. Smack and then... So, yes. Create some platforms, please. Uh, is that enough of a gap? Uh, I hope so. Dang, it's angled. Alright, so what about there? Can you create one there? Mm, no, it doesn't look like it. No, it's, we have to go the long way. Alright, go the long way. So, there. 
Um, that works. Oh, I can just spray this way, like sideways and stuff. We create two. Hmm. Created a longer one. Is that why am I throwing water? I'm still not sure how these hydrants work. Moving them makes it go a little bit faster, maybe. I'm not entirely sure. Yes, I think that's enough hydrant. This will set you down. Um, although I should create like a zone schematic. Some, what something hydrant related, just so I can have it like ready and available. Is there anything back there? I've got a feeling there might be. But, alright. So we'll just get on solid ground, set you down. Thank you for your service. And explore. Let's see. Okay, there's a lava slab just here. Oh, you know, you can aim there, can't you? Yes. I can do it. Yes, you can! Oh, overshot it, though. Whoops. Alright, try that again. You can do it. Yes, Goro. How about this way? There we go. Uh, so question is, what did that do? <laughs> I mean, it opened the path for a hydrant. And I guess, or two hydrants, I suppose. What if it just turn you on and leave you on? No, it's going to drain the battery. Um, hmm. I don't know. Let's just, let's just turn you on, see what happens. Just creating, yep, just slabs. Just a regular hydrant. Can I grab you? Are you too far? You are too far. I'm not ascend. Let us turn you off, because you are wasting my zone I charges. And, hmm. Where to fall from here? I can climb to the fifth floor if I really wanted to. Uh, but let's, I guess, explore the fourth floor. Let's see, you just turn the track around, don't you? Yeah, you do that. Um, that's all my business. <laughs> um, oh, there's the gong. I see. It's in the center. Ah, okay, so we have to. I guess they showed us. We have to angle it. So we gotta change this platform. Be angled towards you. Well, it's gotta be slightly more elevated, I think. Let's just set you down there. Ooh, that's not a good angle. Mm. Well, we made more of these. We can just grab them, right? And just use them as uh, pieces, little puzzle pieces. So we'll just grab a few. Also, these are like detachable things, aren't they? Like things you can play with, things you can fuse to other things. Like shields? <laughs> uh, lava slab, sure. Let's do a lava slab shield. Yeah, sure. I'll take that. <laughs> Hope it's strong, because I imagine solidified lava would be kind of strong. Uh, but yeah, sorry, enough fusing. Let us now do some building. Let us make a ramp for our friend Yunobu here. Just a 45 degree angle ramp. Um, do I want to finish that shape? I kind of do. Make it a full fledged triangle just for the maximum stability. I think I need two of the square ones. All right, let's see, let's see. All right, we'll have you two be nice and straight like that. Grab you and set you on the back. Upwards, please. No, 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 no. There we go. Controls are backwards from what I expect them, but ooh, that's not gonna work. Uh, that's not gonna work for me. Sorry. You know, that's blocking his path. Well, unless uh, <laughs> we grab it this way instead. Set it down like this. Yeah, then we got a 45 degree angle. It's stable. And it should work. You're probably gonna get caught up on something, aren't you, you Nobo? <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Let's see. Well, that little bump in the front, fuck it all up. We'll see. All right, go. 
Uh, it kind of did. <laughs> it shot him straight forward, straight up. All right, no, it's not gonna work. Um, so we gotta take away the bottom one. Is that gonna solve it? Just that? Um, probably. I say yes. Let's say yes to that. So we don't want you either. Just the two of you. Yeah, I guess just two pieces works. The ground can be the base of that triangle. Alright, so set the ramp down there. That's like a perfect angle. Alright, we just gotta send... Send Goro off. Off you go! Yeah, close enough. I got it. Oh, so loud! Rude. <laughs> Why are these locks yelling? Thirsty. Mm -mm -mm. All right, so now that that's over and done with, my question is: There's something back there. Also, can I put like two hydrants together to make a super hydrant? Will it like get more, uh, you know, lava slabs out? I want to find out. We got the. Oh, oops, oops, oops! I dropped it. Oh shit! No, it's on the lava slab. Okay. Come to me, please. Thank you. Let us put you over here, because I saw the other f hydrant. Yes, yes, there you are. And stick it together like this. Double water means double slabs. Um, well, I can't pick it up now. I have to like use my ultra hand to do it. So sure, we'll do ultra hand. Let's see. How much faster can we make them? Doesn't seem like significantly faster, but I do feel like I have more control over it at least. I'm doing it this way. Um, is that enough to walk on? And the game. The game says yes, so I guess we'll do it. Yeah, that worked. But, oh, we did a nice big long one by going this way. Is that how that works? Kind of, sorta. I feel like I did make a better path, so that's good at least. Oh, no, 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 that didn't work. Right, how about one there? I right, need one closer, please. <laughs> can you make one in the center? Well, I guess the good thing is we can always just move them around. Right, let me just put it there. <laughs> and attach this one to ours. We can do that. We can make it so it's like more stable and stuff. Uh, but now we need you closer because we can't get over there. Um, let's detach you. Go upwards, please. Are you stuck underneath? What's going on? I'm getting that. Whoops. This, this is quickly becoming a clusterfuck. <laughs> Gotta solve this. Um, so yeah, my question was if, if there was anything back here. And there might be, there might not be. There's something on that side. I'm just gonna set the hydrants down at this point. Just stick you on the lob slab and make my way over there. Oh, yeah, is there anything back here? That doesn't seem like it, just uh I'm looking behind that rock anyway. But over there also. Yeah, nothing. Alright, fine, I guess we'll just climb here. I don't have anywhere else to go. <laughs> Except backwards, but eh. I'd rather go up. I think we're stuck here, unless we can use Ascend, which we might be able to. Or go around the outside, but I don't think the outside's necessary. I think we can just use Ascend. <gasps> we cannot, no. Why not? Am I too far? Or is that all just like a space that I can't occupy? I think it's a space I can't occupy. Might be another like, you know, barrier or something. Or some lava. Can't go up through lava. Um, okay, so where to from here? We can try to go higher because there is another floor. Or, um, around this bridge. Goro can do that. Uh, can we use the ramp? Yeah, we can use the ramp we just made. Sweet. Yes! Perfect! <laughs> They're letting us reuse assets. That is good. Also, I just heard the zone I noticed me, so let's go take care of them first. 
We don't want you to be a liability here. Oh, you're on your little minecart. <laughs> Let's take care of you with the black Poco Blade. Which charges quickly, it's nice. Alright, yes, we'll take all that stuff. Yeah, Soldier Construct Three Horn. Perfect. Also, that's a special bow, it's shiny. Um, let's, let's drop a bow real quick. Just to see what's so special about it. Um, drop the Zora bow, it's probably not going to be useful here. Um, it's just stronger, just 21 attack. Yeah, I'll take that. That sounds good. Uh, but let's turn you off. We accidentally turned both of you on. Don't want that. Mm, let's see. I guess I'm going to check the map. Where, where, where would this take me? I mean, I do want to get to this room because I think it lets us get yeah, further underneath to those other floors. Um, But fifth floor. Where's the fifth floor? It's up there. Yeah, sure, let's go shoot Goro and explore that larger room over there. So, Goro, come on. Come with me. Here I go! I don't know what Goro actually means. Like, I, I'm assuming it's like a shorthand form of Goron. Or is it kind of saying dude or bro? But I want to just call him Goro. It seems appropriate. Um, but yes, can we just climb? Like, are we supposed to be using the minecarts for this whole stuff? Because I'm kind of just like, not. <laughs> <laughs> so far, and I've gotten like two or three of the um, whatchamacallums, gongs. Uh, but that's an angle thing, right? Um, yeah, we can't get that track aligned, which I guess doesn't matter because I could just fly across to get to that opening. Right, I'm not going to be screwed if I try. I think over there's safe. Alright, come on, Tolan. Give me a push. Do I get stuck there? Ah, da, 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 da. No, but I can't fall. Shit, shit, shit. Shit! <laughs> ah, nuts. Uh, I'm not too far off, actually, so I think I'm okay. There's a little resting ledge right here. Catch your breath. I am glad they gave you little spots to do that. They do give the option of just brute force your way up here. Just climb. Um, is that too steep? That might be too steep. Uh, but I can get underneath here. Alright, I way overshot that. <laughs> I can climb this little tiny little little rock. No, 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 no! Link! Did not mean for you to do that. Bro, buddy, you gotta climb, but do it correctly. Shit. Okay, I gotta rest. Dang it. Got a bit screwed. Can I climb upwards? No. No ascending the easy way. Mm, Goro, you are way in the way here, so no. Alright, I think there is a way to climb up there. I was just doing it a bit clumsily. So let's try that again. I can make it up there from here. Yeah. Get some press here. It's hard to get a good look. But is this not a right angle? Climb there, yes we can, but up here is the issue. Alright, all that is 90 degrees. Is there a way around? Oops, 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 again with the falling. That's me being a dum dum, it's not the game. <laughs> you know what? Fine, we'll just get off here, it's fine. We'll try again later. <laughs> um, okay, Mr. Goro, your services, please. Here I go. Shoot off those rocks, please. Thank you. Oh, it's a track adjuster thing. What do you do? You just, uh, screw the track. <laughs> uh, no. Don't want you. Can you climb up from there? Ugh, no, it's fine. I think that is, like, a 9 degree angle that we can't go across. Uh, but let's see. I mean, I guess we can just get on and see where it takes us. That's always an option. Just, just trust in the cart. If you fall off, then whoopsie. Sorry about that. Try again. Goro. All right. Thank you, Sir Goron. Is this just here? This is just here. It doesn't go very far. <laughs> um, this does seem like a central sort of station, though. 
Yeah, it takes us one, two, three, four, five different pathways. And we can alter the directions and stuff, right? Oh, not you, though. That's the wrong direction. And you do left and right. Oh, whoa, that's a four-directional one. Um, okay, that changes things. Um, yeah, you're more useful in that orientation than the other. So we'll keep you there, actually. And then head backwards. We'll turn you around. Also, does this wear down my durability? No, it does not. Excellent. That little blue spark is what uh, tells it. I can do it! Like, I really hope no quick reflexes are needed when doing these portions while I'm drinking water. <laughs> That'd be very inconvenient to me. <laughs> All right, what to be in the chest? Strong Zonite shield. Do I want it? Um, I don't think so. Actually, no. I'll be, I'll be fine. I don't need the shield. I would like it, but I don't really have space for it. Mm, okay, we can climb up there for sure. All right, that's that's uh, ascendable. We'll just pop out. Uh, but what's up here? That's of interest. Um, so this is where that uppy downy. I think we just shoot the arrows, can't we? Um, right. So we go. We, oh, can we go up down from that orientation too? It works both ways, doesn't it? So there's four positions it can be in. Oh, that's a lot. All right. Um, hmm. Where to from here? Um, yeah, it did come from that way, right? Yeah, because we went to this. Yeah, we went to this little room down here. Climbed up, went to the fifth, fourth floor. Yeah, went around here, just found nothing. Then came through here. Yeah, my goal is to go through this door, right here. So I guess I could go. I could go try that again. Uh, and so I need to just get across the big room, that one. Can I get to it from here? Oh, don't fall off, Link! Don't fall off. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention there. Um, maybe, maybe, because this track that I'm next to, like, goes around this pillar and up here to that room. Have I been there yet? I have not, no. Hmm. But from there, we could take hitch a track here to get to this side. Right? Yeah, we could. Yeah. Let's do that. Yeah, sure. Uh, so first of all, I got to elevate this track here to make it connect. And I can just use my sh uh, bows. So you're uppy-downy. Right, and you're lefty-righty? Yeah, I think so. Eh. It is kind of far is the issue. But yes, okay, that's connected. So let's see, that goes to the track across. Right, and from there should be fine. It connects over there. Yeah, to the central station, yeah. Yeah, that should take us. So we'll grab a cart. Although I should see what else is here. That's a Zonite, isn't it? Yes, which Zonite are you? You are Captain Construct 2. I would like a construct kept into a horn. <laughs> oh, you're looking in all directions, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. No, sir, kept in construct. No, 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 no! He's got the flame. Shit! No, no! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Okay, you're done. <laughs> yeah, that would have been a flame emitter club. No, thank you. Uh, but yeah, the construct horn is cool. Definitely like that. What else is here? Rockets. Rockets, really. Hmm. Is that just to get you up? Is that what you want, want you to do? Go uppy up? And a bunch of arrows too, which is nice. Um, an extra fan. Um, and a, another hydrant. Okay. I wonder now. If I make a rocket powered mine, mine cart. <laughs> How many Zonite pieces would that cost? 
Also, what does this do? It's an elevator. Jeez, this just keeps getting more complicated, doesn't it? <laughs> Dang it. Um, okay, but I do like that we have this little central area from which to like branch out of. Kind of gives this dungeon a bit more cohesion. Um, so there's another rocket up there. Oh, there's several rockets and another fan. Do I have any space on my shields for like a rocket shield just to have one? Um, yeah, I have the Zonite shield. Sure, you know what? Yeah, let's fuse a rocket onto it. Just so that I have a nice quick way to like go up if I need to. Um, okay, it's too far up, so I gotta grab one. Give me, thank you. I guess it makes sense that a Captain Construct was guarding all this stuff. <laughs> this is kind of valuable. Alright, yes. Sweet, rocket shield. <laughs> Alright, um... Yeah, unequip that shield because I don't want to accidentally get boosted. Oh uh, yeah, with the lava slap shield. It's nice and strong. And then, yes, get the minecart. Put it on the correct track. Was this one. To go up. Set you down. And off you pop. Coming us to the fifth floor. Here I go! <laughs> ha ha ha, fifth floor. Right uh, up, around we go. <laughs> Do the tippy top. Do the tippy top. Ooh, no, screw you. We grazed him. <laughs> <laughs> but we get him. <laughs> also, what the hell are you? Ooh. Ah, no, sir. <laughs> That's a big heavy sword. No. Uh, soldier Construct 2. You looked a lot fancier than just a soldier. Soldier Construct 3. My mistake. I hear sparkly sound also. What else do you drop? What is that? What is that indeed? I don't know what it is. Um, let me grab the Ultra Hand. To put that elsewhere. In better view, I should say. Can we get you out of there, please? There we go, thank you. And since I have the Ultra Anakin, I can pose the weapons <laughs> so they take better pictures. <laughs> Not, it doesn't matter at all, but it's just me being persnickety. So, what are you? Zonite Longsword. You look like just a blade. <laughs> um, okay, sure. I think we could replace one of the weapons we have. Because I think something's about to break, isn't it? Mm, or the scepters. I did say the scepters I didn't want. Um, so yeah, actually, I'm dropping the scepter to pick up a Zonite Longsword. Resonates with attached Zonite devices to slightly increase its attack power. So it's already at a base of 13. And it has plus 5 attack. So we can put something good on it. Like a nice Zonite something or other. By Attack power. Yeah, the Soldier Construct 3. I'm sad the Captain one is weaker, but uh, that's fine. This is what, 18? Cuts through plants and large trees. So it's like a giant axe. Although a Lionel. No, I mean, the Zonite stuff it's, is better because it increases its attack. So we'll do that. Get the Zonite Longsword equipped. And fuse the two. Yeah! Nice, 21 attack, Longsword. Yeah! I like that. It's a giant X. 34, my mistake. <laughs> that was 24. <laughs> oh, it's a nice. That is heavy. Um, probably want to drop you next, but uh, we'll see. Also, you have nothing attached to you. If this one breaks, we should make another one similar to that, because I think that's what this one is, right? It has a quick charge, and it also has a quick charge. I should just make it now, why not? Let's do a monster part. Um, what's a nice strong monster part? We can do this one, the Stalnox Horn. 29, jeez. Fast to increase attack power. I have two of those, so yeah. I think the durability of the uh, trap Soldier's Broadsword is actually increased, so yeah. That's what that looks like. Spooky! <laughs> they quiver! <laughs> oh, that is kind of like... Reaper looking though, jeez. All the spiky bits. And it charges quickly too, so that's neat. Looks clunky. 
Uh, I mean, Link's whole outfit is kind of clunky. <laughs> That's okay. But yeah, 35. Jeez. I will take that. How about right? Our Boca Reaper is a nice little good weapon. So we'll keep that. But okay, I guess this is just a pit stop, right? We just came from down there to here, and we can just keep going up. Where will it take us? Up is to where I want to go, yeah. Well, it seems to attach here also. Wait, where, 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 is, where else can I go from here? Nowhere. Alright, whatever. Let us continue. Let's just go up. Alright, Ultra Hand the Minecart. There's already mine cut there, that's fine. <laughs> we'll put another one on. A different one. And yeah, Here I go! Nope, I mean, thank you, but no thank you. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Gora, but we don't need you yet. Also, no! Let's turn you off. And take care of you. Can we just crush you? No. <laughs> Be very gently fan to death, please. <laughs> Book Reaper's badly damaged. That's no good. Until it breaks soon. Soldier Construct 3 Horn, yeah. And the bow. Don't need that. Also, get off. Or turn off. Alright. Alright. So, this is the fifth floor. The fifth and final floor. Although, there's also that bit there. Uh, but we'll worry about that later. <laughs> uh, for, for now, here. Um, so, I do see that I think we just have to go down. There's a bunch of holes to take us places. Um, so yeah, we'll explore this area first and then see where else we can go. I didn't see what else is in this room though. Oops. This little area. Well, it didn't seem like anything, right? We can maybe climb around, uh, although it seems kind of far. Go this way first. So I think to get inside, I want to go around. Um, that's a rickety bridge. I don't like it, <laughs> but we'll we'll cross it. Although it's a bridge to nowhere, because that's well, that's to the floor below. So actually, no, it's not nowhere. Uh, but I want to get inside this structure. Uh, which I think I can do through these walls? Maybe? Let's see. I'll just climb. Let's see. Alright, faster link. Um, no. Not through here. So is there a hole on the other side? Like, over here. On this side of the wall. Did I think of that from underneath? It might be from underneath. Rex will have to jump down to the floor below. Somehow get inside here. Maybe by climbing the wall around and going through the door. The door is open. Hmm. Maybe. I kind of want to climb around <laughs> the building. <laughs> the whole damn building. To see if there's an entrance like from the side. Maybe we could just round the corner here. And then see from there if we see a hole. If we don't, it's probably safe to assume that we'll have to go from underneath. And so Link is sneaky. It's actually a good idea <laughs> on little treacherous platforms like this, so you don't like overshoot it. Um, but it doesn't look like it. No, there's a hole up there. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. We're gonna have to go from underneath. So I guess I we'll just jump off. Right. At this point. Also, what do you do? Up, down. Right. Um, how do you change the track? To go downwards. Okay, to go back to the floor below. Okay. Got it. Uh, but my conundrum remains. How do I um get inside? Because I'm blocked off from this side. Oh, I guess the door's open, right? So I can go over here. Do I have to scale the wall? Um, doesn't seem too far-fetched, so yeah, sure. I'll scale. I shall climb. No, oh, no, no, why Why are you doing this, Link? Why are you doing this to me? Why are you slipping? 
<laughs> Damn it. Ah, this shit again. Ah, fine. Um, have to get to that building. Ah, fine. Uh, that structure over there. Just go, 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 tell them. Push us, push us, push us. Can, if I'm here, I can just do uh, the cart, the my cart. Yes. All right. Yeah. Because I just changed changed the track to go upwards. Although, I could just create a structure and glide over there. <laughs> I kind of prefer that, frankly. It seems like the easier solution. We have infinite of these slabs. Can just keep creating more. Right? Yeah, can just do that. How many do I need, though? That's my question. Also, slabs? We make lava slabs with zonite? Strange. Is four enough? Four is probably enough, because I have these two pieces up here still. Check will take. Thank you very much. And use it to create just like a nice tall structure. Also, I can I can tell the game is chugging a little bit. Like I'm not blind to that. I, can, I do see it. <laughs> uh, I think there's a lot of like particle effects going on that are affecting the performance of the of the poor poor switch. Um, okay, so that'll, that'll I can ascend that. Will that be enough elevation? I'm gonna say just a little bit more. So detach one of you. Put you right angle here. And then, no, wrong one. I attached the wrong one. <laughs> okay, let's so attach you there. I'm gonna attack you. Rotate, rotate, rotate. To create like a little bench. For the big one to stand on. Actually, we just place it here. And then glue you. There. Perfect. There we go. Excellent. Alright, I made a tower. <laughs> I'm gonna use this lava slab tower to just glide across, because fuck that. I'm not taking. The uh, minecarts. So, yes. Shall I climb you? Ascend you. And glide you. That's enough elevation, yeah, because with Tallinn, it should make, we should make it. So, go! Tallinn! Push! Yeah! <laughs> Made it. Sweet! Okay, so we are inside. Uh, so, first order of business is upstairs. Let's go to the highest floor we can. Because I don't think there's any other way in here. Also, is that a mistake? Oh, I think it was. I think that was a mistake. Yeah. No, I meant to get inside the room. I'm outside the room. <laughs> Damn it, it went too fast. <laughs> Alright, we can just get down again. Right from here. Here I go! Right, 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 right. Will this take us? Let's take us here. Shit, I don't think this is where I want to be. Right, I can't just fly over to where I want to go. Because that's where I want to be. I guess I could just go back up there and glide down. No, whoops. Wrong power. Let's flip you around. But sure, have at it, Goro. Go nuts. Here I go. <laughs> have fun, buddy. <laughs> you do your thing. Um, yeah, I think I can just, instead of going around, just glide down here. Yeah, I can just fall. It's fine. It's fine. There's no way to, There's no, <laughs> no harm, no foul. Okay, so let me check the map upstairs, Rex. Right? I want to get inside there. I think I can keep it on my mini map. I cannot. No, it does not work like the outside. So I just want to get like over here. What stamps? That's kind of nice. Um, but is that... Can I get to that room from this room? Let's see. Um, if I went upstairs, not yet. Go to the corner. The corner will take me there, right? Upstairs will be indoors, yes. Alright. I guess I could have looked up also. <laughs> um, no, but we are here. The right floor, yes. Oh, it's just a chest. Is it just a chest? Mm. 
I mean, that's fine. I'll take a chest, but it better be worth it. I don't think that was worth it. <laughs> I mean, it gets me a lot of Zonai devices at the dispensers. So fine, that's a fine reward. I feel for all that work, it should have been something more. <laughs> uh, I'll take it, it's fine. All right, so now downwards, right? There's nothing on this, oh, it goes all the way down, whoa. And the music reflected my <laughs> little curiosity there. Um, all right, sure, so let's just go down another floor. What can we get here? Another chest. Okay. Tell me, what have you? Hmm. Soldier 3 Reaper. That's a one-handed weapon, isn't it? And yeah, I will take it because I guess I need it. Like, my buckle blade's almost damaged, so I think if I do come across another good one-handed weapon, I will toss my buckle blade. Um, this is the main room, isn't it? Or is it one we've not been to yet? No, we haven't been to this one yet, for sure. Oh, yeah, and there's a gong down there. Yeah, perfect. We got to another gong. Alright, Goro. Goro, sir. Announce thyself. There you are. Alright, let's go. Ring that gong. Pop off queen and all that good stuff. Just two left, Link. Let's keep it up, Goro. Goro, Goro, Goro. Ooh, and now the music. Haha. <laughs> it's getting more interesting. There's strings and stuff. It's not just percussion. Strong Zonite long sword. Strong large sword. That means it's two-handed. Do I want to replace my Boko Reaper? For 10 attack. Mm, or potentially something else. I did say the other rod. Uh, yeah, we'll drop the other rod. Do I want to make something now? I don't think so. No, I'll wait. Yeah, it's got a lot more cinematic. There's strings. Okay, so we did get back to the front. The entrance. So, yes, excellent. All right, so there's two more. Do I want to start using the mini-map, the quest markers? Not really, not yet. Let's well, just, we'll have to keep looking, but first let's take a look at the map. Where have we, where have we not been? Um, so that central room, what was that? Mm, it's up here, it's right in the center, duh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I have not been to this side, like this part of the map yet, so that's something I should explore for sure. Um, you're broken, it seems. Okay, so it's got to be the center one, which we can take. Uh, the question is just getting there. And I think these two are also not explored, but also might be this side over here. This island. Where did we? Do I recall? I do recall this bit of lava. No. So not this room. I think that one's been explored. Mm, I guess first this one, and then we'll see. Cinema Commander, hi! You made it! You're home! You're safe. You're probably exhausted. <laughs> All those things. So, so you you go you go relax. I still have one like uh, mushroom spaghetti, protein spaghetti in the uh, fridge. If you want it, <laughs> it's there. If you're ever so lazy to make food, which I would totally understand. Ah, uh, but yes, onwards to the central chamber, central railroad railway station. Uh, can't get to that from here. Yeah, you are all of those things. Uh, you want the apartment to feel like it was <laughs> in the fire temple? <laughs> I mean, I gotta. You, it's 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 four it's four D. It's a 4D experience. I have to like make sure it's yes. It's just as hot as a fire temple. So if if your items are not combusting just you know spontaneously, then you're doing it wrong. How about now? It's still too high. Do I have to go to here from somewhere else? I would like to get there. 
Do I have to take minecarts? I might have to take minecarts. Uh, fine, I'll take minecarts. I have to go, what, from here to down there to up here? And that'll take me. That would take me. We'll just take some time. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. We'll take the minecart. Oh, no, I don't have to. I fucking activated the lift. Never mind. <laughs> I forgot about it. Also, I vastly prefer saying lift rather than elevator because it just it just flows off the tongue so much more smoothly. An elevator just sounds a bit pretentious. <laughs> this device elevates you. It permits you to ascend to higher ground, you see, literally and figuratively. For you see, if you ascend on our elevators, you are you're better than those on the ground. You are above them. But lift just, it just lifts you up, it goes up. <laughs> it's an upinator. Alright, so I said to this floating island, which I can get to from the center here, right? I have it all lined up? I think so, yeah, that's highlighted, this little bit of track, so I assume that's the correct way. So yes, is this one? Uh, which one is it? They're not connected, am I incorrect? It's not, no. Um, well, crap. I do have to go through this one, because the rest are broken. Yeah, so it's got to be this one. So is that what I have to activate? It is, yes. So lucky me, I have a Zone Knight bow, which is pretty cool. These let you use your battery power to charge up your shots, which makes them fly farther, straighter. I guess that was maximum. But yeah, you saw how they just kind of went pew, in a straight line? That's thanks to the Zone Knight bow. Like, that's a very handy little mechanic. I really, really like it. Um, so these cars don't have fans, which is a bit dumb. There's one right there, so we'll just pick this one up. All right, come to us. Like, I, I want to make sure that these Zonite bows that I have, I make use of. <laughs> so I want to use them sparingly. I only have the two. I don't know where to get more except from Stronger Zonite. Yes, yes, thank you, Yunobu. Don't quite need you just yet. Yes, fourth floor. Yes, this is definitely... Oh, you, hi. <laughs> I wish that did more damage. <laughs> so, oh, yeah, our little reaper broke. But that is okay. We can use your soldier construct three horn for making a weapon. Also, it's better than I have now, it seems. Um, so I'm going to replace it. The strong construct bow. Drop you, and pick up you. You would do 18 instead of like 16 or whatever. So yeah, I'll take it. I see the bridge is broken, and we need to fix it to get to break that rock. I can already see that. <laughs> um, we need extra pieces, don't we? Because that's not nearly long enough. Um, you're also broken. Can I just connect you as is? I think so. Yeah, the lava here is solidified. I'm wondering why. So let's attach you there to the edge. To the edge. I mean that works. <laughs> I mean it was totally unnecessary. I can just climb the wall. Hmm. Let's see. What is back here? Extra pieces. I think I need these pieces to make my uh, bridge. Uh, but also, these are pieces that let you float. Like, what I want to do is actually save, make a little schematic real quick, and save it. Because I've wanted to have, like, hot air balloons, like, quite frequently. Ten arrows, sure. And these little, like, metal pieces work perfectly for the hot air balloons. Because they're, like, they're lightweight. They let air go, like, downwards. They're, like, perfect. So, do I want to attach a fan to it? I might need it. I might just need it, actually, just to get up there. Right to the... Yeah. I just think I need to make one. So, okay, we'll come back to you. We know you're here. Um, although, we do need it for the bridge as well. Mm. Yeah, fine. I'll take them, because there's nothing else on this side of the uh, room. I'll take you for the bridge. And then, eh, after we use you for that, deconstruct you and use you to make a schematic for a hot air balloon. Yeah, you go down. And come to us. OK. 
connect you to the bridge. All right, will that be long enough? Let's see. Attach you there. That'll work, sure. And then bring you forward. Up and forward. There we go. That is almost long enough. Let's just set you down there. Let's see if we can just drag you there. Oh man, that would reach. Um, well, what I can do is just hold this in place for just a few seconds. Use recall to say, hey, please go back up there. Then hold your hand this side to, haha, yes. Perfect. Oh wait, what? Why not? Um, that looks like it would attach. Right there. And then do I have to like recall to stop? Why didn't that work? Um, go back up, please. Let's try that again. Go with the other side. And then yeah. do that and recall stop. No? Okay, um, I guess I can use a minecart instead, <laughs> if you really want me to. <laughs> all right, all right, game, I'll use a minecart. <laughs> um, as a little bridge, a bridge to the bridge. Like, they might have another piece that's like perfect for this that I'm just not seeing. <laughs> uh, but this is what I found, so I'm gonna use this. All right, so we'll attach you there. Ooh, it's gonna block his path. Actually, no. Detach you. Detach you to the top of the minecart, maybe. Is that a possibility? It's just on the edge there. Um, maybe we can just attach you there. Let's see. Let's see how this goes. No. To the minecart. Yes. And then you to the minecart. That's the fan, not the minecart. Do I need two? Can I just break these off? These just come off at all. So if they do, that'd be perfect. But I don't think so. No. Doesn't seem like it. Hmm. About there, right there. I mean, that sort of works, but not really. Well, I guess what I could do is instead of trying to bridge it with the minecart. Use the minecart as like a little, like um, little pillar. If you could just stand upright, a little support pillar. So let's attach another minecart to you, I suppose, um, to make it more stable. So it's tipping in one direction. Will this, will this work? Is that a stable pillar? No. I need just symmetric. Let's try that again. Right there? It's a wonky looking face, that's for sure. <laughs> um, actually, will that just work? And put the platform on top. And just rest it there. Uh, maybe? Is that far enough? No, not quite. Push you further this way. Right there. No? Do I have to push you from over there? I think so. I'm gonna make this work. <laughs> I'm gonna figure this out. <laughs> um, okay, so we can put you underneath. Right? Yeah, like right there. And then wedge you right there. Oh, that might work. Will you stick? Oh, it will stick. Sweet. Okay, so we can now push you forward. Right. Oh, nuts. That didn't quite work. Okay, let's try that again. Let's push you. Keep you there. Get another, like, minecart. <laughs> I'm just using these as puzzle pieces. <laughs> um, can I probably just attach you. And not screw the whole thing up. No, we did. Let's try it again. Use you as our little uh, foot stop. Okay, set you down there. Yep, that sticks. Put you underneath here as a support. Like right there? You're crooked, I don't like that. You're right there, perfect. Yes, excellent. We can detach you. Right. I never thought I'd be using minecarts as like 
supports. <laughs> the structural supports. <laughs> For this weird bridge thing that I got going on. Alright, so now we can use... We can put you... Um, let me use uh, Recall to just hold you up in place. You while I put the micro underneath. Um, yeah, it's good enough. Yeah, it's good enough. Um, yeah, we'll just grab the minecart and just force our way up. Oh, that didn't quite work. That didn't quite work at all. Is it because recall was on? I'm not entirely sure. Let's try that again. And just rotate you from underneath. And we'll push the great time. No, it won't. It's it's forced down there. Okay. Hmm. hmm. Okay. Hmm. I mean, is that enough for him? I'm I'm thinking about making the whole fucking bridge. Do I even have to? Can we just shoot you from here? Like, is this good Here enough? Go. It was good enough, okay. <laughs> we didn't need to construct the whole fucking thing. <laughs> Just enough. <laughs> uh, but for some reason, a flame emitter popped out. Oh, they do want you to make a balloon. They do. Hmm. Also, what was all this about? The hooks and stuff. We haven't encountered hooks in a while, so that's a bit... Strange to see. Um, would looks would do I just have to like hook the bridge onto something? No, I don't think so. Alright, yeah, I can't go up there. I mean I could actually use the hooks to go up there. Because the track is broken. Um, but that's okay, I can still use it. Does that take me where I wanna go though? It does not, not at the moment. So I'll come back to you. That was instead. Go this way, see if there's anything relevant. Was that just a flame emitter? Seriously? Is that all that was? Just a access to a flame emitter so you can make a fucking balloon? Don't say that was it. No, 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 no. Don't say that was it. Was that totally superfluous? Did I just waste a shit ton of time building a bridge to nowhere? Like, literally nowhere. Ah, uh, we'll find out. Alright, let's just, let's just get this little platform back up there and make a little balloon. Alright, come, come. Um, they don't give you a balloon is the thing, though. So I guess they do want you to just make it yourself. Unless the balloon is elsewhere in the temple. No idea. But okay, let's bust those things out. We need one balloon and one flame emitter. And those should get us our hot air balloon. Yeah, because we've made this before. I feel like I made it quite frequently. Oh, I got two flame emitters out. Whoops. Uh, well, poopy. Oh, well. Um, I can use them to... Well, no, I can't use both of them, can I? Uh, but yes, alright, so we made a hotter balloon, which I want to save absolutely, so save it in the favorites. Because now we just go up. Also, my buckle thing broke, I gotta replace it. Um, got the long sword, which I sh guess I'll make a weapon out of. Um, yeah, before I continue, I'm gonna take a very quick bite break, because I drank a lot of caffeine and soda, and I gotta go. <laughs> so, BRB.
Alrighty, we're back. <sighs> okay, so yeah, balloon. Let's go up in our um, magical balloon. Ah, no! Don't fall off, Link. Jeez. I'm not even sure it's gonna take us where I want to go. Maybe it takes us there. You know what? Sure, sure, sure. Let's get off. So there's nothing else up higher. I mean, there's a gong. There's nothing else we really need, is there? Although it does happen if we go up high. Nothing. We're blocked off. All right, that's fine. Off you pop. And let us. Uh... <laughs> no, get off, Link. Get off. Oh shit. Oh shit. I fucked myself, didn't I? No, I didn't. Okay, all right. All right we're fine. Oh, excellent. I swear, Goro, how do you fucking get over here? I, I don't understand. What makes you so special? Oh. Yes, go onwards. Gongify me. Oh. Only one left. Almost done, Goro. Almost done indeed. Um, so what is this? This little box. I feel like I need it. <laughs> um, actually, I think I do, because Goro, you can break this. Oops. Right, Goro, Goro, Goro. I can do it. Break it, please, to go to the floor below. And the music, of course, is getting much more intense. And yeah, we can just drop it, I guess. I guess we need you for something, so we're, we'll take you. And, help, and please don't break. Right, it, it broke, it, it did not break, okay. Yeah, so can't go down there. So then, where to? So did I save the balloon? Let me double check. Make sure, yeah, it's on my favorites I saw, right? It's in the favorites. It's in the favorites, yep. Yeah, I think like these s schematics and blueprints are going to be very handy for exploring um, the abyss. Um, yeah, because all the gloom that's on the ground makes it difficult. Like, yeah, we can use this to climb, but where do we take it? And why? Do I want to go down? Down, maybe? Um, I mean, I guess at this point I can just go to the adventure log and see where the last one is. Like, where is it? Just tell me. Tell me where it is. It's on that side. Um, okay, can we just get there on our own? How do we get there? I mean, go to the central room, first of all. And then we'll figure it out from there. I mean, I've got a feeling I have to take this with me. It was way up there. <laughs> So sure, I'm just gonna take the cube with me. I mean, if I drop it though, will it respawn? Mm, don't know. Also, is one fan enough to take everything? Uh, we'll find out. So you're not completely on the track, so right there. And we'll take you with us. Come! On a, we're going on a journey. I <laughs> uh, hope, <laughs> hope it stays. <laughs> Can you just smack it like this? Um, maybe you'd have to... I don't want to hop. Because that wears down the durability. What about this one? Eh? No? What about just a one-handed one? No, really? Do you have to jump? Can I just shoot you? Is that better? Um, well, I mean, it works. And, oh, he's stuck in the front. What happened? What happened? What happened? Shit. What did happen? Um, was I not supposed to do that? Did the track was the track not there? It seemed fine. That's odd. I mean, it made it, so that's a plus, I guess. <laughs> um, so I guess that's yeah. We'll jump on our way up. Go 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 go! Is that enough? Is that enough? It is. I was not actually sure, so that's a bit of a bit of luck right there. So we'll just attach you and keep you there, I guess. Definitely we don't need it. But all right, so I think I see the gong. It's up there, isn't it? Yeah, I can actually see it from here. 
Uh, so we'll just going on this track here. Solve all my problems. Just straight, straight ahead, straight shot. We'll go from there to there, but I don't think we can get to this room. Yeah, I think we have to go to this track. The next one over. You. Uh, but that's also incorrect, isn't it? You want up there. Is it across a broken bridge? Um, I think it is. No, it's, it's the floor below us. We do want to go down. That way, really? Um, okay. Is it connected? I don't think it looks connected. It's not connected, no. Does it matter? Uh, I don't think so, but I think I want to shoot that device. I can't shoot it. They blocked it, didn't they? Oh, sneaky. Unless I can shoot it from up here. Can I climb this little doohickey? I don't think I can. Uh, I'd have to climb up to shoot it. Um, I could do that. I'm gonna do that. I want to equip my um, Zonai bow. See so, yeah. it. Equip that. Up, up, up. And then up, jump, shoot. It's charging, and yep, let's get you. Is that get it? I don't think so. I think I missed. Shit. Yeah, I think I missed entirely. Shit. And I wasted all my battery. I guess if you're skilled, you can just shoot it by arching the arrow. So let's try that. Let's shoot it there. Did that hit it? I don't think so. It might not matter. Like, I'm wondering if I'm just going to fall on the track anyway. I'm just going to try it. Let's just do a little minecart and see if it takes us there. So what's the worst that'll happen? We'll lose a heart. We'll have to start over. From like the last save point, it's not a big, not a big whoop. Um, okay, so we're not on the track, so of course it's not gonna work. All right, so put you there, and smack you do, smack you do, do. Thank you, Goro. Yeah, it didn't matter. <laughs> it's fine. Um, yeah, I think that's where I want to go. This is this looks new. All right, go up. Let's do it. Smack that rock. I see hydrant there, so that's nice. Mm, oh, the lava flows. Oh, cool. So it'll actually um. Yeah, it'll come to us. Perfect. Let us start uh, attaching all of them to each other and making a little. Bridge. Um, would you just go keep going or do you stop there? That's my question. You keep going. We don't want that. So no, 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 no. Get at it. The whole structure out. Out, out, out. We gotta create like a like a little blockade. So I'm gonna put you down. Attach you. Uh, work. That's good enough. <laughs> then we'll use you as a little spanner right here. All right. That should block the rest. Uh, let's just situate you a little bit more precisely. Actually, I want to get a straight line. Oh, well, that, that seems to have stopped it. That's good enough. Right? Yeah, I think so. Good enough. <laughs> bit janky, but it'll do. Also, screw you, Construct Man. Or thing. Let's be sneaky here. Yeah, so after this Construct, we should... Goto, be sneaky, please. I mean, he was. He was completely silent. He wasn't alerted. But that just looked off. Is that Zonite shield? Can't carry anymore. All right. All right. You know, let's do it. Let's do it. That did it. Let's go see what awaits us inside of the room where Princess Zelda was. 
That's where she walked in. There's a bunch of those weird Zonite rocks or whatever, or the Gloom rocks. All right. Should I just warp to the front? I think I will. Let's just, um, actually, no. No, let's make our way down there. I want to glide gracefully down to our destination. Um, do I care about the minecart? Yeah, sure, just to get out there. Alright, there we go. Thank you, Goro-san. We don't need you. Oh, got much more eerie, the music. It's a bit more, like, vocally echoey. Um, we could just float down there to the entrance and then go to the center. So, yeah, we'll do that. All right. Like anything else before I go into this room. Also, what's going to wait us in the room? I mean, I do want to fill up on hearts. I'm short too. So we'll take the yeah, sure, the seared prime steak. And do I have any flame guard elixirs? Just in case whatever this monster is does extra flame guard damage, I want to have something that stacks. Um, although I don't think they'd be that cruel. I'll make one. I'll just make one. Let's get one portable pot out. Um, yeah. Get a little butane <laughs> barbecue out. And they make a flame guard uh, thing. Flame guard elixir. Uh, we need those hightail lizards, right? Oh, I may not even have any lizards. Uh oh. Uh, let's see. Do I have any bee lizards? I don't think so. Because it'd be next to this one. Um, I don't. Uh oh. I can't make any flame guard elixirs. Unless this one does it. Uh, cook it to make an elixir. No, it's just a non elemental tail. Um, what about the fire key swing? Powerful blaze? Uh, no. That's just a monster part. Um, yeah, I don't think I can make a, a fireproof elixir. We'll just have to go as is. I guess just make an extra bit of food since I already have this out. Uh, just give me some health. Health. Give me some health. Um, some bass. Yes. Yeah, actually, the like bass and meat combo does quite a bit. So let's do bass. Let's, let's cook real quick. <laughs> bass, salt, uh, steak. Let's get some steak out. Mm, and what else? One piece of nice raw prime meat. That sounds delicious. And some herbs. Sure, some Hyrule herbs and a mushroom. <laughs> this is a delicious looking meal. <laughs> uh, fish, meat, herbs, mushrooms, and salt. Yeah. Cook it. I'm expecting perfection. <laughs> Chili, salt, grilled prime meat, eight hearts. That is fine. I didn't realize I made a, a chili version, one that like cools you down. Cause I used the wrong mushroom. That was a regular mushroom, but nope, it went. Um, okay, well this is open, supposedly. Do I have to open it myself? No. Mm. Does Goro have to break it? Will that work? No. Um, so then what? That's, I mean, it's fucking lava. I can't just touch the freaking lava. Go fight the monster. I want to. <laughs> um, I'm just not being let through. Examine. Will this do anything? Will this open the door? It will open the door. <laughs> I had to touch the fucking seal. <laughs> Whoopsie. It opened. You gotta smash those red rocks and rescue Zelda. Quote unquote rescue and quote unquote Zelda. Also, this gate like fit perfectly into the little uh, little opening there. Very nice. All right, Goto, um, do your thing, but you can't aim upwards. So how do you propose do to get up there? Do you have to curl upwards? Oh, he does. Okay, sure. <laughs> and now the temple really starts. That's just the front door. 
<laughs> uh, that sounds Zelda? tedious. Where's Zelda? <gasps> That's really, really big. It's, it's also creepy. Little Eye of Sauron. Is that a rock crab? <laughs> it looks like a rock crab. <laughs> Oh, it kind of is. That's like a giant pincer looking thing. Oh, it's a scorpion, isn't it? Or just a weird rock monster. Actually, it's kind of a crab. It is a rock crab. <laughs> I'm sorry, marbled goma. <laughs> Scourge of the fire temple. Oh, so it's big. He's right. That was big. It's so weird. It is. That's a weird color scheme. This guy, ah, it's big. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, okay. Um, all right. So you gotta help me clearly. But how? I have to grab things. I have to grab the fucking rocks. I can't grab the rocks. But, ah. Shit. Um. Did it do explode? I know that. Can I just shoot your eye? I mean, I could. Um. Oh, wait, is it you? You know about it. You went around. Can you do that again? I'm like, fall on top of it? I don't think so, no. Hmm. I mean, I, I could grab them, but... Now what? Explode your foot? Uh, I don't think so. Hmm. I mean, clearly I can shoot the eye, but... You just explode them. Alright, so as long as I can avoid those rocks, I think I'll be fine. So you're saying get the legs. Is that it, sir? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Just charging them. Ah, okay, so it is the legs. Oh, just break it apart entirely. Sure, we will knock you down. Just... Right. Oh, gross. <laughs> oh, this thing is big and gross. All right, uh, get a better weapon. Um, Oh, the Gloom Sword for 41 damage. Um, no, I'm going to do this one and the swingy, swingy, swing. Just charge. Swing it around. And is this enough? Probably. Get up. <laughs> and I wanted some stamina. Yeah, okay, so it does hurt a little. So I can't do that forever. Alright, let's do that again. Come on, Goto. Break his legs. Perfect aim. <laughs> but I guess he's not the one aiming. It is, like, Link. But let's, can you just go from there? Looks like it. Alright. Can we also <laughs> the explosions make this look pretty epic? <laughs> this little pause scene. Um, can I just shoot the eye? Is my question. Um, let's see. Something strong. A diamond? Do I want to just shoot a diamond at it? <laughs> no, I don't. Uh, the soldier construct three horn. You know what? Sure, just get one of those in there. It did not do a lot. No, my hammer thing does much much more. It's already getting up. Shit. Alright, phase two. It's on the ceiling now. <laughs> uh, can I shoot your eye still? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Oh shit! Oh shit, guy, let's get out of here, dude, dude, dude! Shit! Dude, get out of here! Jeez Louise! <laughs> okay, um, you got a bit more serious. Shit, okay, so I think we do have to go over the fucking ceiling. It's gonna be difficult. I guess shoot your eye? I think shoot your eye, yeah. Oh, jeez. Like, okay, so this Goma character is actually from a past Zelda game. We gotta shoot ahead of you, don't we? Shit. Shoot him at the thing's legs still. I think you're right. I have to shoot his legs. But he's, like, on the ceiling now. So I gotta be, like, more deliberate about where I aim. Alright. 
can't just be a random shot either. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Let me just shoot you there. Snap around. Not too late. Oh, it got him anyway. Oh, sweet. Yes, yeah, sure. Sure, 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 sure. <laughs> um, okay, so I do want something stronger. Um, because that 36 attack did only got him to almost halfway. I want to exactly halfway. Just a bunch of smacks, please. Okay, get off, get off, Link, get off. Before he quivers. <laughs> Just get a few more. Yeah, it's hard to aim for the feet when he's on the ceiling, though. Can we just break it now? No, that's... I don't know, that's not sorry. Hurry, 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 hurry. Okay, there's one leg. Shit. This fucking rocks. Okay, we just gotta keep one leg, like, in our... No, don't climb it, Link! <laughs> wrong time, wrong time. Right, no, I want Goro. Okay, there's one leg. Let's see if we can get it from here. No, got close. Oh, it did get down. Sweet. Sweet. This might be it. Big no, 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 no. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> I recall there being a, like, forest Goma version of this one in Ocarina of Time. <laughs> Professor Oak said, Link, it's not the time to use that yet. <laughs> Is it ever, Professor Oak? Is it ever? Also, that was a cool-looking explosion. It was very, like, anime-like. With the whole, like, you know, shockwave coming towards you faster and faster and faster. Yeah, I never liked that about the Pokemon games. How it kind of feels a little, like, hand-holdy. Like, no, 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 like, I know you want to use that, I know you think you have the freedom, but now is not the time. You can be creative only when we tell you to be creative. It's like, ugh, just, just let me do the thing. <laughs> uh, I think that's why I like this. It's meant for little kids. It is, yeah. Although, supposedly, adults can play it, too. Supposedly. And enjoy it. <laughs> oh. But yeah, I think it's why I enjoy games, like... You know, Zelda and stuff. Because, like, the open world adventure lets you go do whatever you want. And here, like, it truly feels that way. Um, I think I'm going to get my fancy Zone Knight shield for the cutscene. Because we're about to enter a cutscene, aren't we? Um, I think we are, but also on better clothes. <laughs> the mounting armor, like that one. And I want to see your beautiful face, Link. Although, is this, can we take this off and be okay? No, it's too hot. We need it. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, fine, you can be mostly skimpy. <laughs> um, but yes, Unobo, it's it's a sage thing. Also, um, we I want to take a picture of the boulder breaker and have it in the compendium. And now's the perfect time. This will always be in our compendium. Like, that's a photo of, like, Unobo becoming a sage, isn't it? It's like, no, that's just his weapon. Like, that was just incidental. All that, you know... Diddy looking stuff that's going on. <laughs> Didn't need for that to happen, it just kinda did. Alright, um can also get it from this angle. Ooh, which one do I like better? Mmm I kinda like the bolt picture. It keeps it a bit mysterious. Yeah, I'll keep the old picture. Alright, you know Bo, what you gonna do? Also, this reveals another cutscene. You get to see a bit more of the story. Also, Gorons have ear holes on the sides of their head. <laughs> Is it also every character's like intent to just instinctively touch something mysterious? <laughs> there could be all kinds of things that could happen. Are you the one who's been talking to us this whole time, Goro? Yes, I am your ancestor from a time long past. I served the first king of Hyrule as a mighty warrior, 
and as a sage who, like you, could command fire. Command fire? You fight using your body as a weapon. Impressive. You are my descendant. Like that little the pride of the Gorons. You defeated that monster, the source of those foul rocks. Oh. It was the demon king who summoned it. He sent that monster to keep you from obtaining the stone you just found. My secret stone. <laughs> Why do they call us secret stones? <laughs> secret stone? <laughs> I kind of don't like that name. Huh. So this is the first you've heard of any of this. Then listen carefully to what I have to say. Let me tell you about the imprisoning war. The imprisoning the war. Dirty of our people. Apparently the imprisoning war was mentioned in a previous Zelda game. Many Link to the past, I think. Ago, so the it's the same war or something different. Days. Yes, tell me what happened. A great evil, the Demon King, sought to conquer the kingdom of and kill everyone who resisted his rule. Raul, the first king of Hyrule, rose up to oppose him, along with me and five other warriors. Five other warriors? So six total. And to fight the demon king, Raul trusted us with secret stones. Incredible artifacts that amplified our power. I stood beside my fellow sages as the Sage of Fire, stronger than ever with my secret stone. The sage of Fire. However, we were no match for the Demon King. I really he like the slow motion, like fabric flowing. Weren't enough to break him. That they have in these little cutscenes. Rauru understood that we couldn't overcome the Demon King. In one last brave act, our leader sacrificed himself to imprison that monster. That was the imprisoning war. I feel like that was a very short battle. Like they just went to go like beat him up a little bit. And then <laughs> maybe it lasted like a minute, but they called it the imprisoning war. <laughs> It's like they didn't. The there was no like assault that happened. There's no invasion of a country. It's just like we went to him and fought him, and we called that little battle a war. The magic restraining the demon king will be undone. He will return. When that time comes, a noble swordsman named Link will oppose him. But Link will need help. Lend him your power. Your fire, the Goron's mastery of fire. In that moment, the duty of the Goron people was clear. Also, that mask he's wearing. Like what is that? To smash the Demon King. I swear that. Is that like an iguana lizard fish? Returns, the Sage of Fire will awaken again. Because if it's a lizard, it it's calling Goron back. Sage and Goron people. Will fight alongside your swordsman. To the like divine beast for the Gorons. I forgot the lizard's name, the divine beast lizard. But it look it reminds me of it. And that's what you need to know about the imprisoning war and of our people's duty. You saved Goron City, but the demon king is still out there. You know, little rock. Take up my secret stone. And honor the pledge I made Secret to the Sage of Time long ago. Fight alongside the swordsman. Blink. Divine Beast Varudania. Varudania so is the lizard defense. It's beast. my duty to help you fight. Hmm. And he wants me to inherit this? Really? Uh, I don't know if I'm nearly as great as my ancestor was. You have to try. But then, if I don't help out, I'd be letting everyone else down. There's no way I'll let that happen. I can do this. <laughs> That's so anime, it really is. Like, oh, I'm meek and powerless, but everybody else is expecting me to fight. So therefore, I will fight. Not for me, but for everyone else. 
They're always so selfless. And somehow find courage. He got a sweet new belt. I like it. I am the Sage of Fire! I've got an awesome new power, Goro! Yeah, we get his power! Yeah, I feel like that's the most utilitarian so far. I mean, they're both good, actually. Little wind gusts from Tullin. And Rock Smashing. Link, hold out your fist. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> We're bros for life. You can count on the Sage of Fire. That's a oh, huge life, fucking fist, by the way. Jeez. And take this. It's proof I stand with you. It's all yours, Link. Your new fancy class ring. <laughs> oh, it's a thumb ring. Neat. We have the thumb and the pinky now, like the ones at the ends. Hooray! With that ring, you'll be able to call on my power anytime, Goro. Is the refresh just as fast? Because this refresh is fast. Beside you, no matter what happens. Okay, let's head back. Hooray! That does it. We beat the fire temple. That wasn't too bad. Like, unfortunately, the, the, the fire temple, the Goron stuff, always feels a little bit forgettable. Which is a bit sad. I guess that's just how it is so far. Oh, it just disappears. <laughs> oh, that's not how you want to withdraw from an addiction. No. <laughs> oh, they're going to have so much so much withdrawal. Oh, so many people are going to be like sick and throw up and go kind of nuts on each other. <laughs> See, they're in shock already. Like, it sucks that withdrawal can actually, like, kill people. It can get so severe that it actually does end up, like, severely injuring. I guess they, they got it easy, these Gorons. Their constitution must be, like, a 28 or something. <sighs> oh, someone's selling diamonds? Seriously? Jeez. Jeez, jeez, jeez. I mean, they're Gorons. They have to have a high constitution. And strength, I suppose. I can hardly believe you're making me worried like that. Why, I oughta... Please don't be mad at President Unobo. Oh, he's president. I forgot. It's okay, Slerico. I'm the one who made such a mess of things after all. I'd just been more careful. Was it his fault? I mean, you kind of got assaulted by Zelda and her, like, magic powers. So, you might be forgiven. <laughs> um... <laughs> But yeah, you did it, you Nobo. You did it. It's all him. Oh. And we have to thank you too, Link. You got rid of the marbled rock roast and smiles are coming back to Goron City. <laughs> all the addicts are gone. We're happier now. <laughs> uh, oh, sorry. He was, wearing, he was wearing a luchador mask. I forgot about that. Ooh. Princess Zelda wasn't angry you ruined the mask, was she? Oh. Actually, we weren't able to catch up to her. That's correct. But it also very much is not her. Uh, but now that I think about it, it seems like she was walking towards that giant monster by choice. Because, yeah, we didn't see her again. Aww. President, you know, about you, maybe Zelda is one of the bad guys. <laughs> you think? <laughs> How come the kids are smarter than the adults? <laughs> no way. Hang on, come to think of it, my ancestor was talking about the Sage of Time. Mm. And that sage looked a whole lot like Princess Zelda, so maybe she is the real Zelda. But my ancestor lived a really, really long time ago, so that'd be weird. 
that means that Zelda. No, dude, you got it wrong. She's a she's a sage of time. She can control time, or at least like manipulate it. So. <laughs> oh. Or not? Yeah. He's. Oh, he's so confused. Yep. Poor you, Dobo. All right. Just don't think about it, bro. We'll get to her soon. Uh, but yeah, so ask your guys at Unobuco to search the area around the city for any leads on the princess. So that means more quests, which is, which is great. Ooh. All right, so he's just hanging out here. And we got the Vow of Unobo, Sage of Fire. Use it to summon or dismiss the avatar. Ooh. The enthusiasm was great and all, but let's not go digging up any more weird rocks. You got it, sir. All right, we're done with this little reunion. We done? Can I can I go on, go on with my adventure, please? Okay, thanks, thanks, thanks. I want to walk away now. Thank you. <laughs> okay, excellent. Um, so I guess yeah, diamonds. What the hell, dude? Seriously, I just buy a diamond. Um, I, I mean, cool. I don't want it, <laughs> but I'm glad I can just buy them straight up. Um, okay, so I guess that does it for the stream. It's already 8 o'clock. Oh, I went over, actually. Oh, shit. Um, whoops. I asked, I absolutely went over. It's so easy to fucking play too much. Whoops. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, I gotta wrap it up then. Um, yeah, next stream is gonna be on Friday. Um, so yeah, that'll do it for now. Um, we'll continue the adventure. Probably just do some regular old explorer. Maybe go to some new areas. And yeah, we'll see what awaits us the next time. So with that, thank you everybody for joining us live or otherwise. And yeah, we'll see you next time. Bye.